Good morning, everybody. Look at how packed this uh, Barbados cherry tree. Look at how full it with cherries. I'm planning this morning, actually, there is a lot to pick. You see the bird get into a couple of them too, but that's fine because we have so many. And I've, I'm planning actually to um, cold press. I have a juicer and just like a little manual juicer and i'm planning on making like a nice juice from it and i'm planning on getting some ginger pulling up a, a little bit of a ginger and uh, basically we'll be with the barbados cherry ginger and some of my sweet maybe sugar in the raw or maybe um some other sweetener, something natural, honey or uh, maple syrup. But I'm not exactly sure which one I want yet, but um, just to make it a little sweeter. It's nice cherry essence, but for many people, many people that I know, it's still um, too tart. So that's why I'm kind of sweetening it up a little bit. I like it just as is, but that way it gives option for people who wouldn't consume it otherwise. That way they would they would enjoy it as well. How beautiful. This is um, a cherry that from flower to fruit, it takes less than 30 days. How nice is that? Look, and it's so packed with flowers too. I want to walk around the tree so you can see it. Yeah, you don't have to wait forever. Look at the little fruits. Look at all the flowers. And there is so many bees buzzing around me. Yes, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful, big one. Big cherry. Beautiful. So yeah. Another. Oh, so yeah, that's the plan. Let's do it. I'm gonna get it in the this trainer so I can just wash it off when I get back, and I will just pick as much as I can. The birds seem to enjoy it as well. You know, it's good stuff when they do that. <laughs> a couple of them fall off too, but not a long time ago. So I'm pretty comfortable picking up a couple from the ground too. You have to be kind of careful when there is more at the same um branch and some of them green because so easily the green can fall off too which is fine because normally guess what i eat the green too uh, they say it's more vitamin c the greener it is like not truly green but you know like kind of mature green like i mean like that and nothing wrong with it <laughs> a little bit more tart sour but that so much so this is gonna be my uh, breakfast juice and I also will share it with the babies because they love to just snack on it just like that so you know it's not too sour because they love it they wouldn't really care for it's sour and the one that the birds already started i just leave it on the tree for them so maybe they will finish it up i don't know <laughs> probably uh, they will start another but um, you never know maybe they would finish it <laughs> and this is a food that when you pick it you want to consume it as soon as you can because 
it ferments very quickly. I mean, I'm sure you can put it in the refrigerator, but my experience with it, the better if you eat it as soon as you can. So you're not gonna waste it. But this is one of my favorite, favorite fruit tree in the garden. And it's always pegged. I remember as it was a little itty bitty tree, I started to um, feed it with uh, citrus gain and it, it responded very, very well for it. And uh, now I'm just, I don't, you know, I'm feeding everything uh, with the uh, chop and drop and uh, compost tea and yeah, just everything organically. But um, if you don't have a setup like a chop and drop setup, um, the citrus gain was amazing for it. Like it responded so well. Yes, so you see it's pretty pegged <laughs> in like just a couple of minutes, really. Look at how full is this little... That's why I love Barbados Sherry and the other thing that you don't have to wait forever <laughs> from flower to fruit because some, some fruits are, I'm like, oh my goodness, when I'm gonna taste it? Like I can't wait to taste it. This one? I can accept it quickly. See, ginger. <laughs> this will be plenty, I think, and this you can see the i can put it like just like that in the ground i can go more on that it all started out with a piece of ginger from our store and then now uh, it grows back every single year so yeah Let's take it in and juice this. Look at how much. Can you open?
one, or you can drink it just like that. I think I don't need sugar. I like it this way. Enjoy. <laughs>